Pete Dawkins loves being around the players, as he was one over 50 years ago at the United States Academy at West Point. His list of achievements at the Academy was unprecedented. Pete was cadet first captain, president of his class, captain of the Army football team that was ranked third in the nation, an All-American at halfback, and winner of the Heisman Trophy. After being commissioned from the Academy, Pete finished infantry and ranger school before being assigned to the 82nd Airborne Division, where he commanded a rifle company. Then it was off to Vietnam, where he received two bronze stars for valor. In 1981, he attained the rank of Brigadier General. At age 43, he was the youngest of the Army's 400 generals. After the military, Pete entered the private sector and the world of finance, where he remains today. But one weekend each year, you'll most likely find Pete on the sidelines. And he says that the players today are different than those 50 years ago, when he was in the game. And the competence of the players has grown dramatically from the time when I, when I played. They're faster and stronger and brighter and probably better looking. There are many rivalries in college football, but it's the players in this game that make it unique. These are young people uh, who soon will be serving the country, uh, who are really playing for the love of the game, not to shine in the NFL draft. And all of that seems to come together in a, a real love of this, uh, of this rivalry. And Pete would know something about that as he passed on going into the NFL and went on to serve his country like these players will be one day soon.